All right, I recently purchased this Festool uh, MS400. It comes with the MFS rail, uh, extrusion rail, 400 millimeters long and 200 millimeters long. And then in addition, I purchased these long MFS 1000, uh, which is 1000 millimeters or one meter long rails. So, um, comes in a nice box, but it's really not something I want to keep it in. So this is going to be my next project here. I'm just going to build another box to house um, th these components. So since my last video, quite a bit has changed around here. I've got a new assistant, and his name is Teddy. And uh, Teddy's a Beagle-Coon mix. And he's a rescue dog from Alabama. Teddy boy. <laughs> so he's just, he's been with us since Labor Day. And uh, he's been working out pretty good. He's a pretty good dog. I'm not sure how he's going to do in the shop, but we'll find out. So let me show you, uh, let me show you the uh, box I've got in mind for this. Uh, MFS set up here. Teddy. Teddy boy. Teddy, look at me. Hey. There you go. Alright, here she is. Uh, just a standard box, you know, this, like I built before. Sliding lid. Uh, let me do this. Let me hide some of this stuff here so we can see what's going on. Uh, there you see the compartments now. And then this open cavity here will house the ball driver and the other accessories that come with it, connectors, stuff like that. And then the two one meter extrusions are, will go on these two slots. And then the uh, um, 200s and the 400s over here. So even though these things are metric, uh, I'm working with inches here to simplify things for me anyway. So this is about I think 41 and a half inches long. Let me just double check that for you here. Forty and three quarter, sorry. So forty and three quarter inches long. And then um, let me hide this component as well. So you see that the uh, dividers I got going on here, and this is the half, and then the two quarters, and then these subdividers are also going to be quarter inch. So uh, it's going to work out pretty well. We'll bring these back in. There's the extrusions. So you see I've got about a sixteenth of an inch on either side of these. And uh, then these dividers in the center are only three inches tall. So that gives me about three-eighths of an inch to get, reach in here and grab those and pull those out. Um, I think it'll be a nice little addition and it'll keep everything protected and uh, you know organized I guess too so let me show those and this guy so there you have it nice nice little box to keep everything organized and uh, Keep it from getting dinged up. So let's get down and start cutting this up. So yeah, so you, you saw the long dimension. 
It's about four inches wide. Let me give you that one as well here. I believe it's four. Oh, it's five. Sorry. Jeez. <laughs> five inches wide. And then the height is... Four and a quarter. So let me give you one more view of it here, kind of the skeleton view. Let's do this one. There. So you can see how the extrusions are housed in there. I'm looking forward to getting back in the shop and getting getting that saw turned back on. It's been a long time. So here we go.